Tonight, for the first time, we're hearing from the trio who blew the whistle on Bob Filner's sexual harassment accusations. It was one of the worst experiences of my life. They spoke to our media partners at KPBS with details about their closed-door talks with the then-mayor. 10 News reporter Dan Haggerty joins us live in Morena with how they knew it was time to make the claims public. Dan. You know, if you can believe it, guys, it was 71 days ago when they walked down those stairs and made it all public. Uh, they said doing so in part because of the way that Bob Filner reacted when they confronted him with the accusations. The trio that helped take down the mayor, attorneys Marco Gonzalez and Corey Briggs and former city councilwoman Donna Fry. They spoke to our partners at KPBS and for the first time started their story from the moment they met privately with Bob Filner and explained the sexual harassment accusations. I walked away just kind of feel like I was in the twilight zone that here the mayor had essentially admitted to a lot of behaviors that were inappropriate for a mayor but he also said he would he would fix things. Next this happened they went public stunning San Diego with the news. We weren't wanting to go public with lurid details we wrote private letters to Bob saying you know what we're talking about. Now it's time to do the right thing. Following that announcement, they say other women with stories of harassment came pouring in. Literally within minutes of leaving the podium, Corey's and my phones were blowing up. Then Filner spoke in a video statement where he said stuff like this. And I've reached into my heart and soul and realized I must and will change my behavior. It was another month or so before the uncomfortable goodbye from Filner where he still didn't own up. I have never sexually harassed anyone. And some people seem to support him on his way out. I'm not particularly sympathetic to the um, conspiracy theorists because they're absurd. Fry says anyone still in Filner's corner needs to wake up. He did not know how to treat people. He abused his power and he sexually harassed women. So I, I think they need to um, kind of come to grips with reality. And Fry said she uh, made the accusations public rather than making just a complaint because she was afraid that Bob Filner would make it all disappear. Uh, meanwhile, our news partners at KPBS will air the full interview on Monday. In Morena tonight, Dan Haggerty, 10 News.